<clears throat> Welcome back to Have You Seen That Film? Previously on the channel, we have discussed 1980's The Private Eye, starring Don Knotts and Tim Conway. On that video, I mentioned that the year previously, they had made another film together, one of several. That film was 1979's The Prize Fighter, which will be the film that we are going to be talking about today. Again, this stars the, the very talented Don Knotts and Tim Conway. The Price Fighter is the story, a story set in the Great Depression about uh, two wannabe boxing legends, in a sense. Don Knotts is a boxing trainer, which in and of itself is just a funny thought to think of. And Tim Conway is his buddy who at the start of the film, they are trying, they're, they're coaching somebody, and this guy just loses and fires them. So then they're down on their luck, and Tim Conway suggests, hey, what if I go back into boxing? I had a perfect streak, 20 fights, 20 losses, which obviously is not the perfect streak you want. Anyways, they go to a carnival, and they they enter this um, boxing competition, whoever wins gets this much money, and a gangster's there and he has the, the boxer lose to Tim Conway in order to set up this boxing scam to make Tim Conway appear like he's this great boxer. In reality, the gangster wants to take over this boxing gym that he sends um, Tim Conway and Don Otts to. So this is his his scheme of getting the gym um, because he's going to make all these other boxers lose to Tim Conway's character. And um, the, the two of them um, start getting ready for these boxing competitions and it does turn out that Tim Conway has a pretty strong right hook, but you know, all the fights are fixed, so it just makes it, he wins regardless. Until he gets to the very end, where it's the, will he lose, will he, you know, will he win, because the, the final competition, the final match between him and the, the heavyweight champion isn't fixed. It's going to be a, a real fight. This, this movie... It's a, it's fun. It's good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I will say it's not the strongest pairing, or not the best pairing of Don Knotts and Tim Conway. It's still enjoyable to watch the two of them together. They are funny in everything they do, and they they benefit from working with each other. I don't think it's as funny as the Private Eyes or the Apple Dumpling Gang, but it does have some big. There, there are some big laughs in there, moments where you, you laugh. And the second time I watched it, I found it funnier. So maybe it's one of those ones where it just gets funnier over time. Um, the, the screenplay was actually written by Tim Conway, just like The Private Eyes was. He, um, in the, the 70s, after the success of Rocky, boxing films kind of came into surge and this was kind of a comedic take on the boxing film. I think what really works for this movie is again the pairing of Don Knotts and Tim Conway because they they're both good at what they do and they work they play well off of one another. Then you know there's a whole Donuts being the trainer of, to Tim Conway is already a funny thing, and there's a bunch of different scenes of him. Um, like he, there's a scene where Tim Conway's cutting down a tree, and he thinks it's gonna land where Donuts is, so he has him move, and when the tree falls, it actually falls right where Donuts is sitting, and he gets out of the way at the last second. Um, there's another scene where they're trying to get a bunch of pictures of Tim Conway because he's this. He's a champ now, and the and Don Knotts keeps trying to get in all these pictures, and everyone keeps moving him out, and he'll be gone for a second, and then he appears out of nowhere, and, and 
and then they stop taking pictures and tell him to leave and um, you know he's just trying to get in the spotlight and nobody will let him be in there so I think the two of them is what works well with this movie and makes it watchable now you obviously have to stretch your mind a little bit because Tim Conway is not a boxer <laughs> he's, he does not have the body for it he doesn't even have the, I don't know, you just, it's Tim Conway. If you know Tim Conway, he's a lovable goofball and a lovable screw-up. And uh, and when you see him in his, his boxing shorts and shirtless with gloves, you're kind of like, yeah, this guy would, this guy would get creamed in a boxing match. Um, but it's the movies, so we're, we're meant to, it's meant to expand our imaginations. Um... Again, it's not the best or the strongest pairing of Donuts and Tim Conway, but it's still watchable. You still have fun. Um, I don't think it's as memorable, and I don't think it's as quotable as The Private Eyes or The Apple Dumpling Game, but I still have a good time watching it. So, for all you Donuts and Tim Conway fans out there, whether they are apart or together, watch The Prize Finder. It is a fun movie that sports fans will even enjoy. So, check it out. And let me know what you think. See ya.